In this video, I'm going to work through an example of an integral that results in inverse sine. So we look at this integral and we think that this looks pretty similar to one of our basic integrals that we know, which is that when you integrate the one over the square root of one minus u squared du, what we get is inverse sine of u plus c. And this looks a lot like that, but it doesn't look exactly like that because we have a 16. And so the trick here, the method, is to imagine, would, wouldn't it be great, wouldn't it be nice if instead of x squared, there we had 16 u squared. Because if we had a 16 in both places, then we'd be able to factor out the 16 and we would get the integral that we know. And so that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to make sure that x squared works out to be the same as 16 u squared. So if we take a square root here, that's going to give us x equals 4 u, or in other words, u equals x over 4. So this tells us the substitution that we need to do to get this to happen. We need u to be x over 4 which means du needs to be 1 fourth dx. So in my original integral, I need to put in a factor of 1 fourth, and then I need to put the reciprocal of that, which is a 4, out front. So now what I have is 4 times the integral of 1 over the square root of 16 minus 16u squared. Remember, that was the whole point of doing that substitution. And then 1 fourth dx, that's du. So now, just like we said, we're going to factor the 16 out of the bottom. So that gives us the square root of 16 multiplied by the square root of 1 minus u squared. Now, the square root of 16 is 4, so the square root of 16 and this 4 divide out. And that gives us exactly what we were hoping for, which is 1 over the square root of 1 minus u squared du, which is the inverse sine of u plus c. And then the only step left is to go back to what the original u was equal to, which is x over 4. So that's our result. So when you see examples like this where it almost looks like an inverse trig function, this kind of substitution can help you out.